It is no secret, it is sweltering today. And on this very hot day, the air conditioning broke at one Guilford County school, forcing the school to send students home early. WFMY News 2's Jess Winters is live in front of Rankin Elementary, digging into the problems many of you reached out to us about. A lot of you have contacted our newsroom, an AC problem at this Guilford County School, and then we'll get an email about a different school. Well, here at Rankin Elementary, they dismissed early because the entire school's AC wasn't working. Both parents and officials said sitting in a classroom with no air conditioning on a 90 plus degree day wasn't a good idea. The principal sent several messages to parents and guardians letting them know maintenance worked on the AC all day and they just left about 20 minutes ago. It's all fixed. Parents I spoke with say they think the district handled this situation very well. Oh, I'm fine because I'm hot standing here, so I wouldn't want my child sitting in a classroom and it's about to be like 92 degrees today, so I definitely am okay with her going home. I don't know why the AC broke, but a district spokesperson said Rankin Elementary's AC is 19 years old. Not today specifically, but the district confirms ongoing AC failure issues at schools like Smith High and Southern Guilford. At that school, the AC is 21 years old. Now we touched base with Winston-Salem for site school, also Alamance Burlington, and both districts said that they've had no reported AC problems so far this year. And again, I want to reiterate that Rankin Elementary in Green Greensboro is expected to open and run as normal tomorrow. Maintenance crews just left about 20 minutes ago, so all signs point to the AC being fixed.